People in Mexico City huddled together for safety as a powerful earthquake rumbled their homes on June 23rd. The quake caused pavement stones to move like an accordion. The 7.4 quake had its epicenter in Mexico's southern Pacific coast. Six people died in the quake. The tremor shook buildings in Mexico City, sending droves of people out into the street for safety. That alarm is a seismic alarm triggered by the quake. And Mexico City has cause for alarm. In September of 1985, the city was devastated by one of the worst earthquakes of the 20th century. The digging continues, the death toll rises. More than 250 buildings in Mexico City have been reduced to rubble. More than 10,000 people died in that disaster. And 32 years later, in September of 2017, a powerful quake centered in the Mexican state of Puebla killed over 350 people. This building in Mexico City was among those affected by the most recent earthquake. Other buildings were rendered uninhabitable. Residents were given a few minutes to salvage what they could from their now condemned home. The damage in Oaxaca City, closer to the quake's epicenter, was more pronounced. Police and volunteers there worked to clear the rubble from a collapsed building. Workers dug out a landslide that had covered part of the road. One man showed the damage to his house. We lost everything in one moment to nature, he said. Others began the tedious work of putting their homes back together. This man moved his belongings to a family member's home in the back of a truck. Other buildings were damaged, but thankfully the effects were mild compared to earlier events. The quake also triggered a small tsunami. Again, nothing approaching the devastation of disasters like Japan's 2011 tsunami. Pope Francis said a prayer for the victims of the quake in his weekly address. Recent seismic activity hasn't been confined to North America. On June 14th, an earthquake shook eastern Turkey. The 5.7 magnitude quake destroyed several buildings. Nine people were injured and one person died. And in Indonesia, a volcano known as Mount Merapi recently erupted twice. The eruption launched a mile-high column of smoke and ash. In 2010, a series of eruptions killed over 300 people in Indonesia. No injuries or damage have been reported this time around. Back in Mexico, a worried child was comforted by a grown-up as people work to put their lives back together after this latest tremor. This is Inside Edition Digital.